Okay, hello and welcome back everybody. This is going to be another part of the Vandalic Kingdom campaign. In the last part we managed to finish off the moors and we just obviously just pushed up towards the Vandalic Separatists which who we are facing now. We are coming up against two horses, one on a go, a couple of skirmishers, well general horse as well. Got a few extra for garrison and then we obviously got the fleet units. Nothing to really worry about as of such, minus the Onaga. And then obviously we've got the towers to contend with as well as we are attacking. But we've got some spears, axes, one crossbow moment which would be very good against the towers. And then obviously we've got a shit ton of horses and then the spear warriors. So we're going to battle with this out. Uh, obviously recently we had the Warhammer trailer. I'd like to get your guys' thoughts and comments about what you think of it so far. I thought it was pretty cool, like obviously all the new stuff in it. That we can see all the unit types, the animation and stuff like that. But I wasn't blown away by it. It was very good, but I'm still sceptical until the 30th of July we've got the game dev, well, the devs walkthrough. And that will actually have some proper in-game stuff. I would assume like icons and all that kind of stuff. So once we see that, I'll be very, very... Oh, but oh, no doubt I'll shut my mouth and be like, yeah, this is good. It does look fucking sick, but I'm still sceptical to a certain degree with some of it, because obviously it's just a trailer. Don't expect too much from it. But it was the same for when Rome 2 came out. They've done the Battle of the Nile, and obviously you could see like everything in motion, and that was a lot better than from seeing what the trailer had. So, you know, it's going to be pretty good. Obviously, that's the most anticipated game for me personally on the PC for until well until it comes out minus XCOM 2, which comes out in November, and obviously Fallout 4, which comes out on PS4. The only, the only games I'm really looking forward to minus uh, saying that obviously I play a lot of Destiny, so Destiny Taking King will be up there as well, which comes out in September. Okay, so we need to contend with the ships coming in, potentially going to be coming from this direction. We want to take this tower out first of all, and then that one, and then we should be able to hit the main focal point. Uh, we've got flaming shot. One of these in skirmish. He may just move these guys in quite quickly. We'll keep these guys there just in case, and we have the general as well. Okay, we've got the onagers, so I'm going to send these in straight away. They've got a ship coming in. Okay, let's take out these onagers quickly. I'm going to take a few hits there. Let's try and take these out quickly. they got the skirmishes there as well, so we're definitely going to push him with the cavalry. Okay, we do have a spear unit, so... Okay, let's push back. Okay, we should have enough fire damage in a minute, so let's start pushing up. Tower should be going down. Okay, maybe not. Okay, 
Okay, I stop pushing. Today's tower gun, we should be alright I think. We're gonna start landing in a minute with these chaps. Okay, let's get the horses to come around. Let's get these guys in. Deadly missiles ready. War back. End of the media. Fearless warriors. Ready for battle. Okay, let's get him charging through. Enemy units have rallied and returned to the battle. Okay, he can take out them on the goods. Keep charging. Let's get these pushing through. Okay, let's get these guys out of here. Come on, let's get out of here. Because we don't release these. Our troops have been. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Okay, we don't release any more horses. Okay, let's send these guys in. Take these chaps out. Men are broken and are fleeing. Elite cavalry. Battle ready. Kill, kill, kill. Men of Germania. Okay, let's get these guys in the middle. Let's get these out of here. Okay, start taking out his general. The battle is turning in our favor. Formation spears. Our men are breaking up. Okay, let's take out his general. 
Obviously, it's a bit of a shambles as well. Not as good as I wanted it to be, but. Okay, let's take out their general. We should be fine after that. Let's send our spears in. General is dead. Okay, let's take him out. Let's send our general in around this way. Let's take out this unit, let's land in, that should be it after that. We might as well get some extra kills. Obviously we lost uh, stupidly some of our cavalry on this one, not the best battle. Almost a bit, bit of a, bit of a clusterfuck, but... Don't know what. Hopefully we haven't lost any units, I thought we should have to rebuild them, it's not the end of the world, so... Oh, there's one more unit, okay. Feature, oh god, I've done really bad on that one. Uh, yeah, probably lost a spearman, and we definitely lost one of the horses, unfortunately. Could have, done, could have gone a little bit better with this one, Vandalus versus Theodric. But obviously, we've taken out the Vandalic Septus now, which is good, and now we can start building ourselves up to take on the Berbers. Nonetheless, it's quick battle. Horses didn't do too bad, considering I did kind of waste them, but. Of course, I mean, they do very bad, only got 27 kills. But they're trying to deal with the tower most of the time, so it kind of makes sense. And the rest, you know, mediocre kills. Nothing special, but still good nonetheless. So, not too bad overall. Indeed. I mean, just one horses, and we could build that up again. So, and they should only have a fleet left, if anything. Let's occupy. Ready for further orders. For the tribe. We've got quite a bit of money now, though, which is good. Ready for orders. Death in battle. There is no finer ending. Let's get three of them, I'd say. So. Obviously, we repair this. And we can start really upgrading stuff now, which is good. Uh, food wise, we can do this. So I'm going to upgrade this one. And then we'll keep the money, rest of the money. We need to try and sort out sanitation in the areas as well. 
this yeah definitely sanitation for this one so for the next turn I'm going to do this for sanitation and obviously we're going to keep building it up from there and so on skill so we're going to do this we can get some food resources and then we're going to do public order for local province which is very good and the force what do we got to be public order for local province or we can do morale in foreign territory recruitment cost for levy units recruitment cost for mercy units I think that would be good. We'll do this one, and then that, first of all for public order, and then we're just going to go to the order this chain. We'll do these two, and then we get integrity, and then recruitment costs for land units will go down. That's going to be very good overall. So happy with that. So the rebels are nearly depleted. We're going to move him up to master soldiers. Put you over here. That should be it. Okay. So we're going to do sanitation for the next one. Because obviously it's very bad and we've got diseases going on at the moment. So we need to try and, you know, exterminate it from our region. And then we're going to start building up. Because obviously we've got a lot of cash now. Obviously I'm going to do some buildings to regain more money. And then obviously we'll go from there to finish it off. Okay, that was good. Sanitation. We'll see. We'll save the rest. So we've got some more food coming in for when, in case we get any more events that happen. Yeah, because obviously we're very weak at the moment for troops and stuff. Citra. We've got a guy to pass us, so we're going to move him up to Hippio Regius because we've got nothing up here at the moment. Uh, Hardrutum. Let's put him up here. So at least we've got something on the borders. And we've got a guy at Carthage. So we need to start building some stuff up. Pretty much. Uh, sanitation is maxed out here as well. But not for this region. But we'll increase that. That's definitely one. And I think the rest we're alright with. Because we've just done that building. Yeah, so next one will be that. And then we'll start thinking about other, other things as well. Okay, we can do this for public order. Infantry unit recruits. Construction for military buildings. Okay, fair days. And we'll go for the same for him for public order. Um, we can only do that one for that. Okay. But we've got one army at least on the borders ready for attack the Berbers or to defend if they attack us. And then obviously the other guys will keep just in case anything else happens. We're still at war with the Roman Empire in the east, so we're going to need to stay have someone in Carthage or in that kind of area in case they push over. Plague of Justinian. Okay. Okay, that was the increase. Uh, we'll save money, I think, at the moment. What buildings do we want for public order? Let's check what public order is like, actually. Hippo Regis is quite bad. It's only gone up because of that. We haven't actually got a yellow building here, so... That will get us some public order. What are we doing at the moment? We'll finish this one off so we can get that, and then I'm going to go straight over to this. I think that's the one that just popped up. So if we've got two turns and I can increase that, public order, and also with this as well. Yeah, we've definitely got to do that then. We saw our public order in this region. Uh, can we increase this? Order. Well, nine here at the moment, so we can get some extra money. Animal husbandry. Have you got animal husbandry? Wheat fields. So let's do construction. Squad is going to go down two. Okay, save the rest of the money, and we can increase this. We need to get one more unit to finish them off. One extra spear, maybe. Yes, let's do that. We'll increase these.
melee attack camera move. Okay, let's do these two. We can get that for next time, and then we can start linking these all together. Okay. So we've got two full army stacks now because we just built them units, and then we're going to start increasing them in Carthage and places like that. Try and sort out the public order so when we do move these units out or these armies out, we don't have to worry about public order. Because the Berbers are going to be quite a strong force to be reckoned with. We're going to need someone to stay in Carthage at least to defend. Okay. But we'll move him up to Citra to attack if need be. Let's see what they've got in the area. A lot of disease. Okay, that's going to help with sanitation. Can we increase this, maybe? Let's do this so we can get the chosen vandals, and then we're going to increase this, obviously, so we can get a better garrison. Let's sit up. Okay, we're going to save the money, and then we should be alright for a few things. Sanitation will be kicking in. Um, we could change the public order now to the church ones. I can get sorry the research for um, the church ones. So we can get better public order. That's what I meant to say. Yeah, very round. Okay, they've actually just moved into my territory. Granary, and then we've got a quarry as well. Very good. Yeah. Uh, we just moved on to that one, so we just finished that. So I want to do this five turns, and then we'll move back to probably the other things. Okay, so that's fur trader, squatter three. We've already got a bad squatter here at the moment, so I'm going to leave that. We have no sanitation until we buy it. Uh, buy it. <laughs> we we steal that building. Okay, you're going to get better sanitation, so we could probably increase one of these. Squad of three, public order three. Public order, yeah, 100% we're doing this one. 50 food. Okay, by the time this is kicked in, this we could do that one. So, public order be sorted in this area. We're going to increase this. Construction for industrial buildings, morale, and public order. So, let's start getting some units into him. Okay, start off with that. Let's do them too. So we've got construction costs and recruitment costs for commanding force and then fatigue rate as well. Very good. Let's start getting some units in Carthage at least. And if they're trespassing, obviously they're probably going to try and make a move soon, I reckon. So we need to get these units built and public order sorted. So when we do want to attack, we don't have to worry about, obviously, public order. Okay, unbowed and unleashed. An ashen sky pretends dark times for us all, yet we've served and choked our enemies with ashen smog. Most Egypt is 2 of 5. Time marches on, we have cheated much, but our people face ever-increasing odds. Mission issued. Survive until the following date, spring at 5.40. So, the fallen empires are risen kings. The old world of empires is dying, yet a new world of kings is rising, and only those with the strength to survive are guaranteed a place. We have that strength. Um, 15120, pay him off. Let's get his influence down. Okay. Let's see what we're dealing with over here. Nothing at the moment. Okay, let's move up then. They've got a force at Caesarea. We need to really push up towards here because they're starting to make a bit of movement. In that area. Ready for orders. Okay. Hippo Regius. 100 food. Public order goes up. Growth. Someone has high walls. We could potentially do that, but not yet, I don't think. We're well, minus one, so let's move him to Citra just in case we want to make a move. And we can increase this actually. Okay, that's cool. That was the thing we just had previously. So 
citation goes up. We need to do a food one, so I'm going to do that. And then we're going to increase this. Get a public order in, and then we're going to get more troops. Let's start getting some of these horses in. The cheaper ones, I think. Light me melee, or we want heavy. They're 529, so let's start off with these guys. Medium. Uh, light Moorish. Excellent health. Fight with us! It's a good life! Come, fight for us, lads! Death in battle, there is no finer ending. God, look how many troops we can get, we can spam out, that's amazing. So let's get them, uh, I won't build any more because obviously money's going to go down a bit from using them. I'll do the same thing so we can get some extra cash out stuff. Let's see what diplomacy is like. Roman Empire, only acceptors are still knocking about obviously. Let's check, some of them were in office now, so yep, yeah, out of office sorry. Let's put him up. Okay, let's swap a few people around. Yeah, they're starting to make some movement over to Passa, so we're going to have to start getting some troops in. We need to at least one full army stack in Carthage, and we're going to move them up, and then we'll start building another one in Carthage, so we can protect it at least. Same for this. Money hasn't gone down a huge amount, so it could be worse. And he's over at Citra. Okay. Nice fire. Sanitation is still quite bad. Public order is quite bad there already, so. Good guy, Citra. Probably get away with one here, actually. What's the worst squatter here? Three or that one? Let's increase this. Because we're going to need some food, anyways. I think I might do both, actually. Because I want to do them higher building ones, so the rest of the money is going to go on troops. A bit of skirmishes, and then the rest we just have to go on two of them, and then one more horse, and that'd be it for these guys. And we'll start pushing them up. We'll move the guy uh, Hadronington up to Carthage, well Carthage, and then move the other guy across in case the Berbers do anything. And they're moving even more troops up. Okay, they move that one back. I don't think they realise this is obviously going to be pissing my people off by doing that, so pretty stupid in their count. Okay, that's that done. Okay, we should be alright, let's just give it a turn. And some of these were out of office. So it's a day out of terms. Okay, let's just leave it at that. Okay. Two more turns and then we've got that one. We can, yeah, so, let's save our money actually because I can start sorting out the public order then, the church regions. So we're going to save now. We've got two more turns, but that's done. And then I'll start pushing up and we can see if we can take on the Berbers. Maybe not yet. I might build some more troops in one of the Carthage ones first. We're going to get start getting a bit more money in now, so... And then we'll start making a move. I 
Theatre, Colonia. Okay, they've got one more turn. We've got one more for that as well. Let's move the agent out. Okay, let's just finish these guys off and then we'll move back. If they try and attack, then it'd be silly. Okay, they're back, and obviously we're taking out Bandic Separatist. Civil War is being finished. Okay, very good indeed. Uh, we are going to try and seek him a wife. Should have done it ages ago. Okay, let's try and seek him a wife. Then we finish the turn. What have we got? Roman morale plus fifteen versus Romans commanded force. Forty-two and leaving. Let's do that. Why not, Joe? And then we can increase these two. Corruption for gov uh, government province. Pretty good. Okay, we're going to start pushing these guys from Carthage over and we'll move the other guy up because they can be finished now. And then we can obviously spend more money with the public order buildings, the church buildings. We need to start doing that now. Control. Okay, let's do it again because obviously he didn't get a wife. We're going to move you up to at least there, because this could be that region. Oh, uh, we can move up to Fagasti, whatever you call it. Move up to there. These guys move up to Carthage. Then we start doing the purple buildings. So, first one's first. Again, these are going to cost a lot of money, so, but once it, probably this region is probably more suited for it. Public order, increasing the priest. First one is that. Okay, that's sorted. Trade wolf. We're just going towards that for better archers. Upkeep cost for all units. Minus 3%. Let's do that. We could place these as well, potentially. We'll get more movement range. Battle movement speed, fatigue rate goes down. So I think we'll do this one first so we can get some more money and then we're going to go for that. Five, six. Yeah, let's start finishing off this tier. Missile rate, 10% for missiles. We can redo this so we can get some trade income tariffs increase and this will be corruption as well. We're getting there, so leave it surely. Let's fall down units. Okay. Did M2 first. But yeah, so that is public order. It's going to cost a lot of money to do these buildings, so we have to start saving. them. And if we start taking some of these regions off these guys, we should be fine, so. Worthy Bride? Yep, let's give blessing. Okay, we can increase this if you wish. And we're going to get sanitation out of this, 100% sanitation. Okay, that's that building done. We can't do anything else. Sanitation. In this area. We've already got sanitation here. Let's increase this and we're going to go and get industry. We need to get some more money. We've got double industry here now, but still. Public is pretty good in this region, so it's not, not a problem. Let's get rid of him. Let's just put some basic units in. Let's get some spears and a slinger. And that's it for the meanwhile. 
Just hope you've got some units to protect if anything does happen. I'm not going to waste any more money unless it's basic units again. I'm not going to do any horses. I may do uh, one more slinger and maybe a couple of axes and that's about it. Until we get more money in. I want to save so we can do some public order buildings and then for when we take over the Berbers there's a few settlements we can grab so Dysentery Local industry Sweet Yeah, it's just save our money I think Guess we can increase this 600 squalor of a cooler, yeah, 100%. Construction cost, let's do this one first and then we save the money. It's going to increase anyway, so I'll get an extra 600, 600 out of it, so can't complain. And that's going to help out at least. Yeah, maybe increase this one, the next one saying that, and then that'll be it for buildings. So we're ready to push on for these to take. Sisyphus, uh, we can obviously attack these guys here and wipe them out when we do attack and then obviously we'll push up and try and take that one out as well as soon as possible, as soon as this one's taken out, but I'll move this guy up in a minute, let's then protect this area first, we should be ready to attack. Obviously they're at war with the Visigoths at the moment, so we've got to be careful. But well, 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 well. Okay, that's quite a bit of my money, but you got to think sanitation, we get some more growth out of it. Sanitation is really bad here, we've got dysentery as well, which is not good, so. Which is affecting uh, public order and wealth, so it needs to be done, it needs to be done. Um... That's going to give it a bit of extra cash. Okay, that's cool. Next one would be this one. I'd say 5,800. We can try and sort out some stuff in this region. Because obviously we're gonna, still going to get some knock-on effects with British differences. Yeah, in most regions. Immigration, a little bit. It's not too bad though. So, it could be worse. But once we take that settlement, it's going to be really good because it's provisional capital. A hell of a lot more money, plus it sorts out this region, which is suffering a little bit at the moment. And then we can push up towards Caesarea and take that. Okay. Let's move up. Let's get our spy in this region. Okay, there's nothing there, so we can use one to literally take it, and this guy will obviously stay there and the other guy can push up towards Caesar they move moved some of their troops back so we should be able to take them out I'd say I'll save it beforehand and then just literally take that settlement as soon as possible and then we'll probably end the part there we've built ourselves up enough to do something now and then that's them built We'll save the rest of our money now so we can increase the new settlements that we're going to take. We need to expand, so let's double check what the diplomacy is like against these guys. Who they're friends with and who they're not friends with. But by looks of things, they're trying to take them out, so... Okay, let's sort out a few things. Population surplus. Uh, we can get a yellow building here, the basic one. We saw some public order and stuff. 
Okay, let's, let's check the Berbers. They're at war with the Visigoths and the trade partners with the Swabians and obviously us. So, we should be fine with this. The attack. Thank you! Oh god, that was big, bless you. Okay, we're going to push up towards here. Let's see what they've got. And these guys are going to attack here. Oh, let's cancel that. Let's quickly save it. Is it weird? Let's cloud save. La 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 la. Okay. Let's move up with these guys. And the other guys can move a little bit forward. Okay, let's kill war. Laying seeds to their hovels. And we're going to move up towards here. And take that. It's going to take a little while to get there. Let's see what they do. We'll move up anyway, so we can take Caesarea as well. Probably take that now, actually. We take this settlement You have further orders? Okay. Let's pair these and then we're going to convert them over. We need to see what they've got here. This guy is going to have to move up and take to pass her. Well, stay there for the meanwhile. It's going to take a couple turns to do that. So, let's see what happens in the next turn. Let's do them to unlock that. And we can actually upgrade all of them. Okay. Let's see what the burbs do. Okay, they're moving that guy over now. They're going to start trying to raid us or attack our settlements. So we'll be careful. Let's actually get a general in here. Ready for orders. Faction leader, arguments. I've got a spring state legacy. Let's put him in there. For the tribe. Public order. Major investment, and we've got the water tank. Development. Okay, that's that done. Then we're going to do this one so we can get some better units. Okay. These guys may have to move depending on what the enemy's going to be doing. So let's see what happens first. Can we attack this? No. Let's maintain siege. We should be able to attack it in the next turn. Okay, they are moving now though, so we've got to be careful. Can't convert that over yet. Can convert that over. Don't have enough money as of yet, but we can convert this over as well. We get some onagers, we get Germanic commanding brigands. Okay. And they'll be there within the next turn as well to back us up if we need to do anything. Okay, that's someone should be gone soon, and we've got the rest of them we've got to take out. Well, the Visigoths are still attacking them as well. Okay, cool. 
Let's try and convert these things over and try and sort it out. We can't convert it over yet. We need 4,500 to do the actual sum itself, which we need to save for. But we're going to see what happens first because they're sending their forces over now. We need to take this one out. There's the main culprit. We should be alright after that, I think. Faction leader's not got too many troops and they're trying to take out the Visigoths. They moved that one away. And that one's gone over to Carthage Nova. So, okay. They're putting all their eggs in one basket, but. Probably trying to save some money, maybe. Sacking it. Okay, he's over there. We've got ourselves a forum. Let's convert that over. The rest of the money will go on this. Let's get rid of some of these. We don't need all them. Army recruitment. Let's get rid of this one as well. Let's dismount with them too. Let's increase these chaps. Well, from industrial buildings, and we're going to move down into this tier so we can get this recruitment for all land units. We'll do one more turn, and then we should be able to convert a few things over and all that kind of jazz, and I'll leave it for the next part. Obviously, we've still got to deal with their forces, but we managed to take a couple of their settlements now, which would be key for us to gain some money. Okay, they're starting to move their troops over now. Climate change, breaking dawn. Darkness gradually abates and life returns to the earth. The crop yield is bound for, children are healthier, and people are optimistic for a prosperous future. Got sanitation where it is. Dude, that's for public order. Let's get rid of that. We'll convert this over for public order. There we go. Now we can convert this over. Oh, we'll do that in the next one, 100%, so we'll convert that over. Okay, we've got two guys there. Okay, we need to save for these ones now. I've just got a kingdom and the Burgundians. Okay, so we're going to end the part there, guys. Obviously, we've just got to remember to do it in the next part. We need to convert a few things over still. We need to move them guys over. And we're going to, with the money we've got left over... We'll start building these chaps up and we can send them over to the west because we're going to need more forces than what we've got here at the moment. We can defend, but maybe not expand too much from now on until we get another force, I'd say. We could take Katina, but that's about it. The area is there, and then we've got the last few settlements. There should be one, two, three. Tingis of the Berbers. So they still got quite a bit of land, and they've got some forces left. We should be able to battle with them in the next turn because they're pushing up now to attack us. We've got two armies in the area, but we need to sort out this wall first off and try and sort a few, few things out because we haven't got any garrison units to help us out really. And same here, we'll try and f figure a few things out. So I hope you enjoyed it. If you liked the video, give the video a like. If you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and tell me how you think the campaign is going so far in the comment section below. I'll see you all in the next part. Bye-bye.